I have these beneficial nematodes from Biological Biologic and they are safe for people, pets, and plants. They hunt down and kill pests, pests, insects in the soil because they eat the larvae. Um, they will go after, see if they have a list of what they will hunt down. It says it controls over 230 different pests from black vine weevils, cabbage root maggots, corn root, crane fly larvae, cucumber beetles, cutworms, flea larvae, flea beetles, fungus gnats, iris borers, Japanese beetle grubs, which we have a lot of Japanese beetles, mole crickets, onion maggots, pine weevils, peach tree borers, raspberry crown borers, and a whole lot of, of other things. Now we have used these before to control fleas when nothing else worked. And it is time to put some more down. I put some um, similar to this down around under and around the beehives. I'm going to put a little bit more there and around the peach tree and in our yard to keep down the fleas because I don't care what anybody says, those chemicals that you get from the vet are not good to put on or in your dogs or cats and they don't really work either, at least not on the mutant fleas that we have. So I'm going to mix this up and start spraying. Alright, I'm going to set you down here. Okay, that's some in the backyard where the dogs come out, but dogs aren't the only ones who can pick up some tag-along fleas. So, I like to spray the front yard as well, and the, um, the nematodes will, the nematodes will also multiply and spread, so you don't have to, to actually try and cover your entire property with the spray. You just want to hit some patches in different areas and then let it spread. They'll tell you on the package approximately what area it will cover, what they've got. But like I say, if you just don't, I don't buy enough to totally cover every square inch of my property I couldn't afford to do that but what I found last time is like I say you just hit patches and then it will they'll spread and it'll work all right so I'm gonna spray around our front more left. I'm going to spray some more around the bee area, around my squash, and my peach tree. And that will 
That'll do a good job, I think. Before I dump the rest of this, now the instructions say that I should spread these on the ground as well because there may be, still be nematodes attached to those. So I'm going to put them here. I put some around the peach tree while I was over there, but I'm going to put some, the rest of them, here around my hives. The reason I'm so wanting them here around my hives is I use bottom screen boards and the nematodes for a major part of my IPM, my um, Integrative Pest Management Program, um, which is as chemical free as I can possibly manage because, and the nematodes, one of their 230 pests that they will eat in the larval stage are small hive beetle larvae and while that's not the worst beehive pest it is a persistent beehive pest and so the more you can deal with it without chemicals the better Now, let's get away from the ladies before they get ticked off at me. Uh, beneficial nematodes, they go in, they live in the ground, and they, as I understand it, they invade the soft bodies of bug larvae, and I guess they don't really eat them per se so much as they multiply inside them until the larvae die and uh, so they're they're using the larva as a host to multiply their population and I would certainly want as many of them as possible and as few of the small harv small hive beetles and grubs and squash beetles as possible. I'm not comfortable using chemicals at all. And I'm cautious about using um, essential oils, which is something that people are starting to use as an organic, as an organic way of dealing with um, problems, illnesses, the, the, the the varroa mites and all of the sicknesses that they carry um, without using the chemicals. But with not knowing how the bees can handle 
those essential oils or what strength is safe, um, they can be as dangerous as the chemicals, if not more so. But at least the, with a small hive beetle, I have a fighting chance to, to deal with them naturally. Naturally meaning no chemicals, no man-made chemicals, no natural-made chemicals, um, just pest-eating pests. <laughs> um, just uh, nature doing its thing. <laughs>